Hey everybody, it's uh, Kyle here. Just wanted to show you guys the CD collection, obviously. Iowa, Slipknot, Bad Vibrations, Day to Remember. And I'm pretty sure this is the Deluxe Edition, if I'm not mistaken. AFI, the Blood Album. It's internal, Green Horizon. Sounding the seventh trumpet, Avenge Sevenfold. From Under the Fort Tree by the Fallout Boy. The Fallout and Limitless. Lost Prophets, Liberation Transmission. 18 Visions. I'm pretty sure this is until the ink runs out. It is. Fall Out Boy, Infinity on High, Promise to Burn, Bring Me Hanley, Dear Diary, My Teen Angst Has a Body Count, Verse the Last, Classic Post Record Album, Cancer Empire, Zonaria, pretty sure that's how you pronounce her name, but if I'm wrong, correct me, Just to Brazil, Orange Roaming Dictionary, Iconic 90's Emo Album, Fall Out Boy, Take This to Your Grave, such, such a good album. Amazing EP, Escape the Fate, There's No Sympathy for the Dead. My all time favorite album, Escape the Fate, Dying Years Latest Fashion. Death in December, Beautiful Tragedy. I think people should check this album out. It's really underrated, post art core, in my opinion. And speaking of underrated post art core, Odd Project, The Second Hand Stuff. An amazing album. Rami Hanley, the moment. I think this is Pyrathon. The Burden of Sorrow. I know it's called the Burden of Sorrow. I just, I don't know how the band names. I don't know off the top of my head how the band names pronounced. I haven't watched any of the interviews or part of it. Look into that too much. I just fucking jammed the music, you know. It was, uh, short-lived side project by Tim before he did the try to kill your wife thing but anyway moving on death spiritual healing slayer rain and blood anthrax among the living some classic thrash albums here falling in reverse coming home book from a valentine venom regular edition pretty sure Deluxe. Suicide Silence, The Black Crown, Brain Drill, Apocalyptic Feasting, I can get out, Animosity, Animal, Metallica, and Justice for All, Death, The Sound of Perseverance, Arguably my favorite death album, Symbolic. This album is fucking amazing. Uh, this is uh, from the show Metalocalypse. This is Death Clock. This is their first album. The Death Album. I think this is the debut one. Is it? Let me see. Yeah. Yeah, I think it is. Yep, it is. This is the this is the new one. It's the first one. Okay, just making sure. Uh, Rings of Saturn, Embryonic Anomaly. That's my favorite album they've done to this day. Oh, this is such a good one. Elliot, False Cathedrals. This album is so fucking good. I highly recommend it if you're into emo from like the '90s and melodic punk type stuff. Anthrax, Spread the Disease. This, or Fistful of Metal, is my favorite album by them. And this is a great death metal album. Death, Scream, Bloody Gore. Death Human. Rings of Saturn. Ultu Ula. And this is Merciana, Let It Begin. Really underrated. Would recommend checking them out. 
little, start off with a little bit of grunge here. Alice in Chains, Dirt. This is a landmark grunge album. Let's see. Alice in Chains, Facelift, Beartooth, Disgusting. This is really the only Beartooth album I like. This is In This Day, Sleeping Beneath the Ashes of Creation. This is an underrated metalcore album. Rise Against, Appeal to Reason. Can get it fucking out. Is it glued together? What the fuck? There it is right there. Then Sevenfold, The Stage. Yeah, I think I think it has a little bit of glue on the back of the stage, but yeah. I'm pretty sure this is Misfits. So I think this is the collection. I, I'm pretty sure, cause I remember getting that. Motionless and white. Reincarnate. First to last, Heroin, Scarlet Drive, Adelphia, Dead to Fall, Villainy and Virtue, Kill Switch Engage, As Daylight Dies, Escape to Fate Self-Titled, Regular Edition, Punk Coast Pop 4, this is a classic. Data Remember, for those that have heart, Deluxe Edition, Classic Case, Dressed to the Press, really underrated. Seether, Finding Beauty in Negative Spaces. Still Remains of Love and Lunacy. As Hope Dies, Legions, Bow to a Faceless God. This is a really underrated metalcore band. Bone Palace Filet, Chiodos. I don't know if that's the deluxe edition or not, but yeah, I really need to get a fucking chair to sit down and do this. Next time I do this, Lamb of God Wrath, Him, Screamworks, Love and Theory, and Practice, chapters one through thirteen. The Black Delaya Murder, Nocturnal, Thirty Seconds to Mars. This is War, Metallica, Rack of Lightning, Carnifex, Dead in My Arms, this is my favorite album they've done, Typo Negative, Bloody Kisses, Parkway Drive, Killing with a Smile, really good album, and this is their best album, full length in my opinion, We Stitch These Wounds by Bell Brides. That fucking remake was a joke, by the way. When Broken is easily fixed, Silverstein, it's a little banged up, which pissed me off. But still a landmark post hardcore album. Bullet from a Valentine, Fever, Lamb of God, Ashes of the Wake. Sorry if I'm not showing them perfectly, by the way, but at least you can see the artwork. I Am Ghost. Those we leave behind. This is the last album that they did. Escape the Fate. Hate Me. This is their worst album in my opinion, but it's still a good album because Escape the Fate, in my opinion, does not have a bad album. Mayday Parade, A Lesson in Romantics. Definitely their best album by a long shot. Metallica, Master of Puppets. Matera, Vulgar Display of Power. Mudvayne, The New Game. Saint Asonia's Asso self-titled. Uh, this is Eaten Back to Life slash Horror Sections. This is a split EP that these bands did. Recommend checking them both out. Check them out randomly. Because oh. I'm Cannibal Corpse. I was looking up their album. Wanted to check this band out and I... 
saw this release with another band, and I was like, fuck yeah, I'll get this. The Black Delea Murder, Ritual, Ezele Dying, Powerless Rise, Devil Wars Prada, Space EP, Miss May I, Deathless, Asking Alexandria, The Black, their last good album, but I like some of the songs with the self-titled. Coheed and Cambria, and Keeping Secrets of Silent Earth, 3. Bring Me to Horizon, There Is a Hell, Believe Me, I've Seen It, There Is a Heaven, Let's Keep It a Secret, you guys know that album. If you're like in scene culture at all, you should know. A Day to Remember, What Separates Me From You. I was just listening to this album Sunday on the way to get Hardy's. Desolation of Eden, Chelsea Grin, aka their best album. Him, Razor Belly Romance. One of the best albums ever. And this is one of this is another all time favorite, Nevea, Design the Skyline. Illuminado Chiodos. Brenda Bulmer is such a good fucking vocalist. With Roots Above and Branches Below by The Devil Wears Prada. Classic album. One of the landmark Crabcore albums, in my opinion. This War is Ours, Deluxe Edition, Skip the Fate, Bless the Fall, His Last Walk, their best album, I Set to Kill, Reach, Your Day's Greatest One Axe, that's a fucking amazing album. Spies Icon, The Ills of Modern Man, this is one of my favorite, all-time favorite Deathcore albums. Silverstein Discovering the Waterfront, pretty sure this is the Deluxe Edition. Rise Against the Sufferer and the Witness. Elect the Dead by Surge from System of a Down. Solo stuff is really good. All American Rejects move along. Pretty good album. Black Parade, My Chemical Romance. Good album, but it's not emo. Fallen Reverse, Journey Is You, Full of My Valentine, Poison. I want the deluxe edition of this. Suicide Season, Dream of the Horizon. Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge, My Camp. Skylet Drive, Identity on Fire. This is such a fucking good album. Set My Friends on Fire, You Can't Spell Slaughter Without Laughter. Set the World on Fire, Black Bell Brides. This is really their last album that's good from start to finish, in my opinion. Regular edition, This War is Ours, Escape the Fate, amazing album. Meteora, Lincoln Park, Reckless and Relentless, Asking Alexandria, classic album. The Somatic Defilement, Whitechapel, this is their best album. However, This is Exile is amazing too. Count Your Blessings, Bring Me the Horizon, their best album in my opinion. Creatures, Motionless, and White. Also, this is my favorite out full length they've done. Against the World, Winds of Plague. Hope is Gone, Slipknot. I think this one's censored, unfortunately, when I got it. Darkest Red, Agony Scene. If you're into Slipknot, I'd recommend checking them out. They kind of have that influence along with like 2000s metalcore vibes. Speaking of 2000s metalcore vibes, Ascendancy by Trivium. Good album. Universe by the Irish Front. One of my favorite Deathcore albums. Fra frail Words Collapse as I lay dying. Uh, Shadows of Security as I lay dying. The deluxe Edition of Screaming Fire by Bullet from a Valentine. I don't know if I have the regular edition or not. Enema of the State, Blink-182. Sirens, It Dies Today, one of my favorite metalcore albums. If you know me personally, you know that It Dies Today is actually one of my favorite metalcore bands, period. Speaking of favorite metalcore albums, When Excuses Become Antiques by Phoenix Morning. And a crabcore classic, Attack Attack, Someday Came Suddenly. I fucking hate their new single, It Sucks! Fucking trash. Sorry. Anyway. Stand Up and Scream, Asking Alexandria. Change of pace. Uh, an offer. Can't refuse.
Panic at the Disco, A Fever You Can't Sweat Out, Tac Tac, Self Titled, Deluxe Edition, Fall in the Reverse, Just Like You, Deluxe Edition, Fall in the Reverse, Fashionably Late, Deluxe Edition, Suicide Silence, The Cleansing, so amazing. Dead to Fall, Everything I Touch Falls to Pieces, Ugh. Cannibal Corpse, Tuna. Tomb of the Mutilated, Job for a Cowboy Doom, Whitechapel, this is, this is Exile, and brand new Deja and Tindu. Really fucking good album. Texas is the reason. Do you know who you are? One of my favorite 90 single albums ever. Armor for Sleep. What to do when you are dead. Alisana, A Frail Wings of Vanity and Wax. I wish I had the original artwork of this. The Use, self titled. Amazing. Sunday Real Estate Diary. Oh, oh, this is Matchbook Romance. Voices. Doesn't have the cover to this, but the CD is fine. Sunday Real Estate, pink album. <laughs> they just literally said, fuck it, we'll make it pink. The Used and Love and Death, Landmark post hardcore album of the 2000s. Dead Poetic, New Medicines, this one's really underrated in my opinion. Second and Serenade Awake. If I Simber Underground. Right. Roses are red, conversations. Gosh. And mainly what's left is just like some fucking samplers and shit. I got this randomly. Incubus talk shows on mute. Like, yeah. Get scared C D sampler. Just a Vic victory rec record sampler so you know no nothing too crazy on paper the last of it but it is what it is Woo! oh there's more over here I almost forgot. <laughs> Sorry about that. Thursday, war all the time. I got this for really cheap on Angry Young and uh, Son of Dork, Welcome to Loserville. This is a really underrated pop punk album, in my opinion. The Cure, Pornography. Letter Kills, The Bridge. Speaking of which, I'm actually wearing a Letter Kills shirt right now. Thrice, The Artist in the Ambulance. Thursday, Full Collapse. Really good album. Oh, fucking hold on. I'm fucking sitting on the floor. I don't give a fuck. My Darkest Days, self titled. Blink 182, Take Off Your Pants and Jacket. This is such a classic. Escape the Fate, Ungrateful. I'm pretty sure this is a little luxe. Is this a little deluxe edition? No, no, it isn't. Oh, no, no. The deluxe edition is red. Fuck, sorry. I have them both. I just get them mixed up sometimes. Hello, Mud, Come Clean. Rob Zombie, Hellbilly Deluxe. I'm pretty sure this is Life is Peachy by Korn, which is actually my favorite album of those. Korn, self titled. Drop Dead Gorgeous in Vogue. Escape the Fate, I Am Human. Saves the Day. Through being cool. Ugh. Green Day, Dookie. Backstreet Boys, Millennium. I know all these rock, punk, and metal CDs, and you randomly just see a Backstreet Boys song. But I fuck with their music. So, yeah. Rise Against, Siren's Song of the Counterculture. The Offspring, Smash. Blink-182, Dude Ranch. 
Sleep with Sirens, feel. Uh, if you want to see the artwork, which don't want to waste too much time because I'm trying not to let this be too long, but I'll get it. I'll get it so. it's, just, it's just a fucking feather. It's not fucking crazy. If you know, you know. I wanted to. Okay, this is Pantera, Cowboys from Hell. Probably my favorite album by them, to be honest. Okay, this is a. What is this? Is this a sampler? Or... Let's see. Oh, no, this is Yesterday's Rising, When We Speak, We Breathe. Brendan Bulmer fronted this band, if you know, you know. He originally fronted them. The Veronica's hooked me up. Kill switch engaged, the end of heartache. Excuse me. I may just end up stacking these on top of each other to make it easier for you to see. Silence in black and white. Silence in black and white, Hawthorne Heights. Skip the foreplay. Nightlife. Really classic crab horror album. Bullets and Belvedere, Reflections. This one's really underrated in my opinion. Kid Dynamite, self-titled. This is some great fucking melodic punk, man. Uh, Sell the Sky. Now that we're waiting, EP. This band's actually coming back, and they've actually released some really good content. They should be the new Crabcore Kings. Attack Attack's new shit is fucking trash. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't like it. Fucking trash. When Love Met Destruction, Motionless and White. I mean, it's so fucking stupid. Uh, oh, we're hyping up the crab course coming back, but you fucking do a, a, a just lame-ass fucking shit. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. If you like the new single, that's okay. Escape to Fate, self-titled, deluxe edition. I love the bonus tracks on this, Liars and Monsters, The Final Blow. Glamour of the Kill, The Summoning. Bleeding Through. Love will kill all. This was a pretty good comeback album by them. Disarm to Descent, Kill Switch Engage. All Time Low, Put Up or Shut Up. Till Death by Capture the Crown. Oh man, do I love this album. Sexy. Mm. Master of Reality, Black Sabbath. Sabbath. Pantera, far, far Beyond Driven, so this is the last of them. I'm sorry that I'm not doing it all delicately. But it's working. Oh, it's working. All right. All right. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to do this in one part, or at least get as much as I can. All right, now we're gonna turn the lights on. Those right there are the rest of my CDs, but let me move my fucking shit out of the way. While I do this. Oh, for fuck. Green Day, Insomniac. Just stack them right here for now, I guess. Make sure I get everything right. This should still not get in any simple plan. The Sun and the Moon by The Bravery. Been listening to them a lot recently. Especially this year. Bravery. Yeah, I thought this was a self-titled. Just wanted to make sure. My favorite song on that album is probably Out of Line. 17 Days, Three Goes Down. 13 Ways to Bleed on Stage, Cold. Another band I've been listening to a lot this year. Yep, Jonas Brothers, self-titled. They're actually better than people give them credit for, in my opinion. Drunk Enough to Dance, Bowling for Soup. Last Stop, Suburbia, Alistair. This is a really underrated pop-punk album, in my opinion. Like, honestly, I feel like people should give it more credit. Tomorrow, SR71.
leave disturbed. Dead Ends and Girlfriends, Alistair. I love that band. One Fell Swoop by The Spill Cannabis. This is a really good album, in my opinion. I need to get another one of theirs that I really like. Imperial in Fear and Faith. Also, this is FM Static. Okay, I thought so. What are you waiting for? FM Static. If I take a second, it's just because I'm making sure that I pronounce everything right. I'm a perfectionist. Though, I still might mess up. Sound the Alarm saves the day. They have a song on here that ha that's on Madden 07 soundtrack. Pretty awesome. It's Head for the Hills. Early November, The Room's Too Cold. This is a really good one. Motion is Dead, The Juliana Theory. Oh, this is a good one. <sighs> Search Party Never Came, Banna. Say Hello to Sunshine by Finch. Let Oceans Lie by A Hero A Fake. Far from the lies by Greeley Estates. And this is just another Dear Diary, My Teenage Has a Body Count. This came with the vinyl that I ordered from Hot Topic like last year. Random Cult Lodge Thingy comp Compilation Music on the Brain Volume 1 from Smart Punk. Has some like cool shit on it. Brazil is really underrated, by the way. So is Hidden Plain View. Otavis by Otep. Don't You Fake It by the Red Jumpsuit Apparatus. Godfather, Ned's Atomic Dustbin. Something for Nothing, Chunk No Captain Chunk. Collide with the sky, pierce the veil. God, you, you would see kids wearing a pin shirt with that album everywhere. Oh, this is a good one. The Downfall, Belay My Last. God, Deathcore Masterpiece, I tell you. Love this fucking album. I saw a pullover on eBay. But it's like in a 2XL, so it'd be really large on me, so I don't know. But they're a good band. Famous Puddle of Mud. This is a pretty solid album, actually. Put this is this is a pretty solid album by them. This might even be my favorite album by them, as weird as that sounds. Because usually earlier albums are better, but like this one's pretty solid. It has some bangers on it. About a Burning Fire by Blindside. I recommend you guys check this out. Just a really underrated band. That deserves more recognition. Good Charlotte, self-titled. The Eminem Show by Eminem. Almost Here by The Academy Is. This album is so fucking good. And there's a... Skeptics and Believers. That song is so fucking sexy. My god, man. <clears throat> the Cadiff Choir. It dies today. God, I love this album. It's so fucking sexy. Which everything by It Dies Today is sexy. I mean, I, I mean everything they do is just perfect. New Limb of God, self-titled album. Got this to Target. P thank God it had a parental advisory stick on it because I hate censored albums. They're so fucking lame. Uh, yep. The Opposite from Within by Caliban. That's a band I've been getting into recently. 
and I I heard of them, but I had never really listened to them until like now. I randomly listened to a song called I Rate Myself from The Undying Darkness, which sounds very similar to As I Lay Dying, Showers of Security Era, and now I'm just love it. I love them, so... I got a couple of CDs off of theirs for $15 so I could add it to my phone to listen to. One Man Army in Cypherum. Uh, I think a friend of mine will like this one. So I know he likes that band. Controversy Loves Company by The Audition. Oa Sign by Brazil. I hope I didn't fuck up the pronunciation. If I did, my apologies. Better than knowing where you are. Spidalfield. Dark Light. Him. Yeah, I, I should warn you guys, it's going to be a long one. Audio and Murder. Frantic. Antidote for Irony, So They Say. Self-titled EP is also really good. Plus 44, self-titled. Except it's just pink splatter instead of blue splatter. From Autumn to Ashes. The Fiction We Live. Light It Up by Ref Theory. This is just great. Oh, yep. Okay, this is staying. 14 Shades of Grey. I was just making sure because... I didn't want to find out that it was something else and completely mess it up. Because sometimes... They're, like, the Mudvayne self-titled album was, like, all white. And you couldn't see it. So I just wanted to make sure. Does this look infected? Some 41... I love this album so fucking much. Everything on this album is fucking perfect. See you next Tuesday. Parasite. Lower Definition. The greatest of of all Lost Arts. Is it is it of all or if it is it just of? Oh, okay, it is of all. I thought so. I was just making sure. <laughs> Miami Nights is probably my favorite song off that album. Salt the Wound, Carnal Repercussions, one of the best Deathcore albums of all time, in my opinion. One of the best Deathcore bands, even. Beneath the Sky, What Demons Do to Saints, this is a really good one. And of course, Anal Cunt, fucking A. This album is so fun, dude. I need, I need more Anal Cunt CDs. Oh, man. Quiet Drive, when all that's left is you. I'm adding their, this album onto my phone because Spotify wanted to be gay and take that album off. Spotify, you're fucking gay for taking that album off, by the way. Redeemer, Norma Jean, really good album. Preacher Within the Ruins. This album is just sexy as fuck. If you know, you know. Another Deathcore classic, Deaths by Oceano. Oh God, the aftermath, Norma Jean. I think a lot of people are mad at their vocalist for something. I can't remember, but I don't fucking care. Son, I Loved You at Your Dearest by As Cities Burn. Holding a Wolf by the Ears from Om the Ashes. Creator by Hands. Fuck you CDs for falling, you fucking... I'm trying to show you off and this is what you do to me? Quit being shy. My CDs are fucking camera shy, man. Deliver Us, Darkest Hour. Good metalcore album. Candy Ass by Orgy. Really good band. Light From Above by The Black Tide. And my favorite album might not be a popular opinion, but Postmortem by The Black Tide, this is my favorite album they've ever done. 
and a good friend of mine's probably gonna love this one, Curse of the Crystal Coconut by Al Storm. I heard of them, but I really just started listening to them because a friend was posting about them a lot, and they're pretty fucking cool, man. I'm not gonna lie, they're pretty fucking cool. I fuck with them. Portrait of the Goddess, Bleeding Through. This album is really fucking good, to be honest. Like. Fuck. Your World on Fire in Fear and Faith. Undoing Ruin, Darkest Hour. Shade by Knights of the Abyss. We're the problem. U.S. Bombs. Angel City Outcasts. Dead Rose Junction. Give You Nothing, Your Revolution. Another good Deathcore album. Shot Down Sun, The Human Design. Oh, this is a so underrated metalcore band. An early ending, Bloodlines. Got a tank of theirs somewhere lying around. Suicide Silence, self-titled EP. This is the real fucking self-titled, not that fucking bullshit. Fuck that whack-ass shit. Oh, I hate that fucking album so much. Anyway, <laughs> Squares by <laughs> Miss White. Fucking hate that failed... Oh, it sounds like a failed version of Deftones. Anyway, Thrall Junkies by Soil. Conviction by Aiden. Fuck. The Sail at Dawn, Imperial. Our Gang's Dark Oath, Aiden. Rain in Hell. Aiden Murders Feast of the Blood Monster Dance Club Massacre I was thinking of the song Murders Come With Smiles For some reason Just instantly like Murders Come With Smiles Because that's one of my favorite songs on the album But ugh Insect Song Beyond the Embrace This isn't my favorite album But I still really, really enjoy it This band's really underrated Found it Found it on Indie Outlet. The Darker Shades of White, Corpus Christi. Biomechanical, The Empires of the Worlds. From First to Last, Aesthetic, EP, really underrated. Awesome. Robots, fuck you, get up here. Robots, Casino Madrid. Want to find their first EP, but have not been able to. Love this new album by Framing Hanley, by the way. Envy. So glad they came back. Really awesome album. All Killer, No Filler. Some 41. Awesome band. The Electric Sounds of a City Painted Black and White. Bless the Fallen. Sound the Trumpet, Dear Whoever. Produce a Scream, Self Tiled EP, Good Russian, Post Hardcore. Forever Scorned at Ice Day. Fuck. Get your ass up here. Life in Ruin, if hope dies. The ground is rushing up to us, if hope dies. War of Love, negative. I'm glad I got my hands on this. I did not think I would be able to, to be honest. Becoming I, and Loco. Love this album. It's got me through a lot of tough times. North Star is this thing loaded. Really underrated band. 
as a lay dying, shape by fire. I need a whole fucking like big ass room to just do this video in. Against the elements beyond the embrace. This is the album I was talking about. That's my favorite. I listen to it a lot. But I remember the most I, one of the special times I listened to it, I was listening on the way to South Carolina randomly. But anyway, start something, lost profits. Good shit. Sacrament. Lamb of God. Where a myth fades the legend, Alisana. Bad reputation. Mountain New Breed. So glad I was able to get this before it sold out, because I don't know if they're going to be making music anymore. Where you want to be, take a Mac Sunday. Lovers are queen. I am ghost. Peace of mind. Iron Maiden. Feel the Steel. Steel Panther. Such a fun album. <laughs> Broken Side. BC 13. Basically their self titled EP. The identity, identity crisis thrice. I would you. I, there's no songs. There's like there's like no songs of this on YouTube. At least not last I checked. There's nothing with with this album on YouTube. Teenage scream. That's outrageous. They kind of sucked after that album, to be honest. Back burner for the fallen dreams. Catalyst, Wither Eye. Game of Life, Arsonist Girl, the Girls. Sirens and Condolences, Bayside. The Great I Am, Graceful. Art of Dying, self titled. Skites, airplane, everything perfect on the wrong day. Secrets, the ascent, or ascent, I don't know. Best damn thing, Avril Lavigne. Kingston Falls, Armada on Mercury. Love, hate, hero, white lies. Say anything is a real boy. Different shade of blue, not loose. Get a card, Ocean Avenue. Nickelback, Dark Horse. Panic Channel, one. Chemical Vocation, A Misfit in pro Progress. Broadway Calls, Good Views, Bad News. Metro Station, Self-Titled. The Better Life, Who Goes Down. The War Within, Shadows Fall. Catalyst, Newfound Glory. Welcome to Slut City, Annotations of an Autopsy. This is back when they reprinted it, like last year. Got the hoodie too. No Name Face, Lifehouse. Sing the Sorrow, if I. Riot, Paramore. Worse than a fairy tale by Drop Dead Gorgeous. 
Auk and Trayer, self-titled DP. This is Waking the Fall on the Vin 7 Fold. I don't have a cover thingy to it, sadly. But, yeah. Oh, Grave, where is thy victory? Here I come falling. Pick your poison. EP, famous last words. So fucking good. To Vicerade, famous last words. Genesis, what was me? If you don't first, by 10 after 2. Paint by numbers, plastic. Sticks and stones, newfound glory. Well done with this side. Gray, the embarrassing beginning. Us from outside, inspired by the threat of failure. Air I breathe, great faith in fools. God, I love this album. Eskimo Callboy, self title DP. Daughtry, self titled. Page Avenue, story of the year. Louder Now, Taking Back Sunday. Seven, seven Wiser, self titled album. Strada's self titled. Senses fail from the depths of dreams. And last on this damn thing City Slips and Fames, Scary Kids, Scaring Kids. Gonna pull out my fucking tote thing and I'm gonna do part motherfucking two. Alright, everyone. Uh, time to finish this. This is finished my CD collection issues. Subtitled and the blood blow from a Valentine himself. Queen tragedy and disaster. Joe Tigran, my damnation. And love said no. Him. Graveyard ship, motionless wife. Just breathe, love your hero. Near life experience, break the silence. The opposite of December, poison the well. Uh, these are glued together for some reason. Um, fart. Design your fate. Scars of tomorrow. Searching for solid ground. Knockout. Being the wolves ten years. The unveiling. Cry of the afflicted. Questions and answers to sleeping. Uh, you can see that there's a poster right there. The same as I. But anyway, I'm gonna focus back here. The inevitably of a strange world, Halifax. It's now or never make me famous. Subtitle Blink-182. A Hostage in the Meaning of Life, Brazil. The, the Pick of Destiny. Cause it's the pick! Destiny, child, you know it will be rocking cause it's fucking insane. Anyway. Is there anything else? I missed. Make 
Sorry. Oh, yep, there it is. I thought I missed something. Because I was wondering. I was like, I knew there was something else there. Inside the fire. Disturbed. Contem Just a random collage of songs, victory records. More victory record shit. I fucking missed that shirt. Sorry, I accidentally turned it off. Your favorite weapon by brand new. Is that everything? It should be. Okay, it is. We are always searching. I am ghost. The same old blood rush with the new touch. Cute is what we aim for. From the shallows, beyond the unknown. Cinderella night songs. Casually dressed and deep in conversation. Funeral for a friend. She watched the sky. Skylight Drive. Allegiance as Blood Runs Black. One of the best Deathcore albums to ever exist. If not the absolute best. Which it very well could be. Shadows Inside. Miss May I. Disclaimer to see their ear to for, forget apostasy. I, I I don't know how to properly pronounce that off the top of my head, so I'm sorry. Like I said, I, I try to make sure I get them right, but there's some that I may not know off the top of my head. Anyway, Snow White's Poison by it's drawn through stereo EP. Can't believe I found this for cheap, especially amazing. Nothing less, nothing more. Kill Whitney dead. Stained. Dysfunction. Oh, I got that at Pop Vault in, in Brunswick. And I went there Saturday. They didn't have any fucking CDs. They took them all off, which is pretty fucking lame. Reimagine Hands Like Houses. I actually got this for free. Rise Records sent this to me for free, along with the other CDs I ordered. Be Mine Valentine. Drop Dead Gorgeous. Azazel, Ashes and Ashes. Silent Civilian, Rebirth of the Temple. The Hurt Process, Drive By, Monologue. These Hearts Forever Ended Yesterday. Devil Wars Prado, Zombie EP. Is that everything? The Machine says everything was held in place. Such an amazing album. Can't believe I got this for like $7. At the time, it was really worth a lot. But now, Rise Records, I think, put it back on merch now. So it's a little more affordable. It's like $11. Anyway, I got this for free. Uh with an order for merch now and I actually I'm not a see I got the self-titled issues album for free but I really like this one Black Diamonds I like the early stuff man it's fucking good anyway believe what we tell you the sleeping I was just listening to this album today One Flight One Flame probably my favorite song on the album Stay Classy to Hotness Jeeving, Abandon All Ships, Slipknot, Self-Titled, Nothing Personal, Once I'm Low, Dear Love, A Beautiful Discord, The Devil Wears Prada, Thousand Sons, Lincoln Park, Album title goes here, Dead Mouse, 
or you could just call them Dead Mouth Five, whatever you want. But I'm pretty sure it's Dead Mouse. Silverstein Rescue. Suicide Silence. No time to bleed. I actually have another copy of this album. Cause I over I over killed the shit out of the CD back in the day. The poison. This copy is sealed because you know I already have one that's open, so I just decided to keep this sealed. So I decided to just keep it sealed. I didn't really want. I just decided to keep it sealed. Vince Sevenfold, self-titled. Punk goes classic rock. System of a Down, Toxicity. Vince Sevenfold, City of Evil. Slander, Dr. Acula. Monster Monster, the almost. Demon Days, Gorillas. Follow the leader, Corn. This is just a fucking Victory Records sampler. I got a lot of those when I used to order from them a lot. But they don't have the, the band merch that they used to have. They're fags. They fucking took it off. Dear Agony, Breaking Benjamin. They're fucking gay for doing that. Anyway, Blink-182, greatest hits. Menace the Midnight, Lincoln Park. I think I have like two or three copies of this because I wore out, wore out the copies of this. Oh, fucking hell. Do not drop it. Okay, this is an all contrary cassette. <laughs> I just wanted to show this. Just got the, uh, this is, I, I think there was only 10 made. This may have been the very first pressing, if I'm not mistaken. Because I'm pretty sure I got it when they first printed it. Anyway. Rifles at recess to whisper in tongues. Oh, here it is. The other copy I was talking about. I got it from Suicide Silence themselves. For really cheap. No time to bleed. This is the good copy. It's infamous. Deluxe edition. Edition. Receiving end of sirens between the heart and the synapse or synapse. I, I don't fucking know, but it's one or the other. But it's a good album. Sunday Flood. Velvet is Falling. If you like down these emo, check these guys out. They're pretty good. For all those sleeping. Cross your fingers. Good album. This is Fragile Shade Beneath the, the, These Ambitions. I was thinking of the Sony Outbreak of Heartache. If Only You Were Lonely, Hawthorne Highs. I have not taken this thing off yet. But I will one day. I just, I put them all, all in when I was moving into my new house. Mesmerize, I'm pretty sure. Is it? I hope I'm right. Yep, I'm right. Because <laughs> I, I, I knew that Mesmerize was... I'm pretty sure it was this album cover. But Pacific Standard Time. Curbside Journal. Matchbook Romance. Stories and Alibis. Matchbook Romance. West for Wishing. Athela, self-titled. I got that randomly for free, to be honest. So I don't know the band all that well, but what I listened to, I liked. So forgive me if I somehow didn't pronounce it right. But anyway, this is a masterpiece. Scarlet O'Hara, Lost in Existence. All that remains, the fall of ideals. This is a true classic. Here's some random CDs. Wait, these aren't music CDs. But I do have some that are music CDs, so give me a second. 
Some of them are just random DVDs that I don't have cases to. But Bands Warp Tour 2010 compilation. This one's this is worn to fucking shit. <laughs> and this is exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah. No one of my copies of Minst to Midnight. Right in here. Of course. I wore that album out so good. Classic case. Losing a life. Alison. Alison on the emptiness. Casualties. Resistance. Outspoken for all those sleeping. For all those sleeping, I will finger your fucking asshole. Oceana, The Tide. Such a great album. Nevermind by Nirvana. The Return to Melancholy, Red Roses for a Blue Lady, I don't know why this is in this, but anyway. Go Radio, Lucky Street. Pennywise, All or Nothing. Punk Goes Pop 3, got it when it first came out. A lot of good memories jamming that shit on the CD. Sinner, Drowning Pool. Nirvana. Pretty sure this is Greatest Hits comp, comp, compilation, or however you pronounce that. Best of Fuel. Aiden, From Hell with Love. This is a live album I got at Walmart. Like, until like 2010. <laughs> Summer 2010. Lady Gaga, got a Fame Monster. I got this one when it first came out. Pretty sure. Got this one first came out as well. Cannibal Corpse Torture. I know, two completely different things. August Burns Red. Constellations. But overall, my CD collection is pretty much just mostly punk, metal, core stuff. You know, hard rock. Just some random samplers. Nothing too crazy there. Yeah, nothing. Just another fucking sampler. Cause I got a lot of those. This album is really underrated. Screaming Bloody Murder. This album does not get the respect it deserves from some 41 fans, in my opinion. Forever the Sickest Kids, self titled. 30 Seconds to Mars, A Beautiful Lie. This is a fucking masterpiece, and yeah, it is just it's great. Everything about it is great, okay? As a Dying, Dicas. Modern Day Escape, House of Rats, good shit. Shocked I found that at FYE back in like early 2011. Good Charlotte, The Young and The Hopeless. So last two, Lincoln Park, Hybrid Theory, Slipknot Volume 3, the subliminal verses. Witness, Bless. The Fall, Heart Scarred, Tomorrow We Escape. Under Oath, They're Only Chasing Safety. Paddock Park, A Hiding Place for Fake Friends. Boys Like Girls, self titled. Sugar Colt, Palm Trees, and Power Lines. Nickelback, Silver Side Up. Knapsack, this conversation is ending starting right now. Emmanuel, soundtrack to a head rush. Elliot, U.S. songs. Mineral, in serenading. Day to remember, homesick. Good shit. Dark light. Him. Oh, I didn't know I had two. Wait, did, do I have two copies of this and I don't know it? Huh. I just, I think I just found that out. Veronica, hope for a brighter future. Cause I, I could have swore that 
whatever. Anyway, moving on. State of Revolution, Fight Forever. There is no songs of this band on YouTube, but they're actually really good. I should upload their songs on YouTube sometime. I'm just a random channel. Nightmare Anatomy, Aiden. I'm not a fan, but the kids like it. Broken said. Star Static, Sugar Colts. Worlds Between Us, Life in Colored Squares. Um, a Daggers Drawn, Sea of Treachery. Awake, Dream Theater. And that's pretty much everything as far as CD cases go. These are just loose CDs, Fans Port Tour Compilation 2009. Random Victory Records Sampler with bands These Hearts, Close Your Eyes, Corpus Christi. From like 2011. Mudvayne Self Titled, which I cannot find a CD case for anymore, sadly. Uh, I. Dying Joy is Fashion. This is the original copy. I played it the fucking shit. <laughs> Never getting rid of it. Another disc from 2009 tour compilation. They always came with two discs. Fearless Records, Bonus Sampler. Uh, I have good memories with this. Very, very good memories with this. It also came with a Rise Record sampler. Uh, Punk Goes Pop 3 did, at least, from my memory. Well, Texas is fucking obliterating Colorado, bro. Wow. Anyway, um, that concludes my CD collection. Hope y'all have a good day, and I'm out.